My name is Julius. I'm 62 years old, and I'm addicted to balloons. At this point, where have we come as a human race? My life a movie, the way to be acting. She said that she like on my eyelids. This life I gotta appreciate. Remember the time I ain't had this. But when they see me in a mansion, tell me that they probably We all have that one special addiction, whether it be candy, coke, or having Bruh. balloons. Uh, well, uh, well, that's just this guy. They're beautiful. They're soft, smooth, delicate. I have a connection with them. Intellectually, I know that balloons are not alive. But sometimes I wonder if it's my love for them that brings them to life. Twinkle, twinkle, little. Oh, God damn it, Sharon. Can you go shut that balloon up? My first reaction was, wow, balloons, that's kind of strange. Julius has been addicted to balloons for over five decades. No, whoa, whoa, whoa. Five decades? That's like, well, one, two, three, four, five, give her the seven, minus the nine, subtract the ten. That's 50 years. This guy has been having s*** with balloons for 50 years. Bruh. It started when he was a child as an innocent attraction to the shapes and colors. Now Julius has filled his home with over 50,000 balloons. Oh, uh, I have so many questions. But Julius's obsession with balloons goes beyond shapes and colors. My love for balloons is also a sexual love. When I see a, a beautiful balloon, my heart starts to flutter, and I get aroused. Hey, baby. Oh. I'll take a 12-inch and I'll inflate it to 11 no inches. That way it can take a lot of abuse. I'm holding one, you know, hugging it. I'll kiss it. Oh my God! Oh my God! Lots of people out there that feel the same way as I do about balloons. But there's two groups uh, of the lunar group. You got the poppers that get aroused by popping balloons, and you got your non-poppers. Wait, wait, wait! I don't need to kink shame here, but there's more of these people. Since then, the sound of a balloon popping devastates Julius. And he even rescues balloons he believes to be in danger. I'll go to car dealerships and um, do what I call a balloon rescue. When they set them out early in the morning, they're really beautiful. And as the sun uh, bakes on them, they get really dull, uh, misshapen. I feel, you know, like I give them a second chance at life. Well, I don't mean to bother, but last time I checked Animal Planet, balloons were not on the endangered species list. But Julius doesn't share his extreme love for balloons with many people. The only people that know him is my family. My wife thinks it's strange. Well, hello, son. What are you doing? Oh, nothing, Dad. Just giving this balloon a quick smack. <sighs> Come here. Well, that's all the disgusting content I have for you today. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the style, make sure to uh, let me know in the comments and give me some constructive criticism because I haven't done this commentary thing in a while. Anyways, also, if you liked the video, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll try to upload again tomorrow. Peace.